When you flip a light switch, the lights go on. At least that's everyone's expectation. But in today's hotly competitive energy marketplace, it's critical that power producers be very efficient in generating electricity, not only from a process automation standpoint, but from a business efficiency view as well. That dual efficiency, the use of real-time plant information throughout the application, Microsoft's server and office systems, and the Wonderware software architecture are what make Kansas City Power & Light Company stand out in the utility industry. The company has created a performance monitoring system that allows management and plant operators to monitor and evaluate the economic performance of their production, as well as automating the power generation process itself. What we attempted to do, and we were successful, was to bring together information from all the different operations at the power plant. We have coal handling, we have water treatment, we have air quality control, we have the operation of the boiler itself, and we have the operation of the turbine and the resulting operation of the generator to make electricity. Uh, this is a factory whose raw material is coal, and it produces a product, electricity. And uh, in that way, it's no different than any other factory, and we have to control all of the processes associated with that. Um, we can end up with a lot of cost, but not very much cost, depending on how we control our resources. The system was designed and installed by KCP&L with support from Sega Incorporated, an engineering and system integration firm based in Stillwell, Kansas. It's implemented using Wonderware's factory suite automation software from Invensa Systems Incorporated. This includes terminal services, the thin client version of the InTouch HMI software, and the industrial SQL Server real-time relational database software built on Microsoft SQL Server and analysis tools. These work together to consolidate plant data, and Wonderware's Sweet Voyager industrial portal software gives users access to tailored information on plant performance and operations and brings real-time plant intelligence to its employees. Sega was asking for some technologies that Wonderware was just on the verge of releasing in Sweet Voyager and Terminal Services. We were confident Wonderware would release those on time and on schedule. Sega successfully used those and the project went very well. We could allow access to that information through a, a thin client. We're using Internet Explorer and Sweet Voyager. Uh, we have access control in place. So we don't want those people who uh, don't have uh, a need to know certain types of information. We don't want them to get to that information but we do want everyone who needs information to be able to have access to it. So from their computer, either at the plant or another plant, or at, at home, um, if they have a dial-up into the server, um, they, they can get the information. The new system gives KCP&L staff the ability to see how all systems are running at any given moment, and it provides the information needed to compare real-time results with past history and future projections. Kansas City Power & Light is a leading provider of energy-related products and services for homes and businesses in the Kansas City metropolitan area, including both Missouri and Kansas. The company has four primary plant sites and 19 generating units that can produce more than 3,700 megawatts of electricity. One of the more advanced plants operated by KCP&L is the Lacine Station jointly owned by KCP&L and Western Resources of Topeka, Kansas, and located 40 miles south of Kansas City. A performance monitoring system has been in use here for a few years, but Lacine now has implemented it so ordinary internet browsers can be used instead of proprietary applications. Lacine uses several different types of control systems to manage coal handling, water treatment, boiler management, and power generation including several different distributed control systems and automation systems based on PLCs. One of the critical elements in the development of the browser-based system was that KCP&L needed to merge data from all these different control networks and deliver information to different departments in real time, allowing for proactive responses to changes in energy demand and resulting in increased optimization of equipment and energy production. What we're trying to do is bring together multiple sources of data into a central computer system and convert that to information. 
Uh, we define information as the reduction of uncertainty. And uh, for managers and operators and engineers uh, at a power plant, uncertainty is, is a real enemy. We want to be certain about what's going on. The Lacine station is a modern coal-fired plant with dual power generation units. Because there are so many support systems that facilitate power generation, each has its own control system. Each system's interaction with others must be monitored to ensure peak performance of all variables in the power generation process. We found that uh, the Sweet Voyager applications, we found it very useful in being able to deploy information systems for a, a much more wider, different types of uh, business uses. Uh, the traditional performance engineers are still being served, but other business users uh, right up to uh, higher level management are looking at these screens and looking at the, uh, the operation of the plant. So I found that it's, it's opened the door for providing plant level information to uh, much higher levels uh, of management within companies. The new performance system has been paying dividends since the first moment it came online. As soon as the application was live, an alarm in the application went off saying that there was a problem with the piece of equipment it was monitoring. And the operators were not aware of it. Um, on their screens, the data showed everything to be normal, but their data wasn't detailed enough to bring out what was wrong with a piece of equipment in a stream of pieces of equipment. They discovered the problem and fixed it immediately. So the system really paid for itself within 60 seconds of being started up. Sweet Voyager gives me access to the information right at my desktop to where I'm not having to go out and collect the information manually. Well, I, do, I do like the system. It's worked really well for us. That success continues on a daily basis. And it's one of the reasons why, with the flip of a switch and a little help from Wonderware's factory suite automation from Invensys, the lights shine bright in Kansas City.